How's everyone doing today? My name is Sarah Tonon, and welcome back to Paradigm. If you see the expression on my face being irritated, I messed up my OBS recording, and I can't use the video of me recording the last whole chapter that I played, so we're going to be going back from a load here. Wait, I didn't do it. This one. Load. Oh! There was so much- there was- there was so much that happened in this last chapter, in this last little bit, and I- um, We move forward. Kyle the Cosmic Walrus is with us. Say hi, Kyle. Hello. Alright. Kyle, you're gonna have to go through this again. <sighs> okay, here we go. Oh, I didn't even notice the elevator the last time I looked at this, mind like you. Like most things in Krush, it is out of order. And like most things in Krush, it is probably extremely dangerous. Yes, it stays out of order. <laughs> Alright, talk the to you. low poorly constructed elevator. I risk my life enough living inside a poorly constructed power station. Okay, you're not going in there. Pick it I up. really do love you, elevator. Despite all our ups and downs. Not that way, don't pick them up that way. Window. Sometimes I contemplate life when looking out the windows. Then I realize it sucks. Fair. Then I think about dragons and wizards. Fair. Hello, Talk to window. It. Uh, is this a skylight or no? Okay. Use it. Windows, the most efficient exit, and the coolest. Wait, I can't just exit through the window. <laughs> uh, okay. Pick up the I window. I have never felt this way before. Oh, no. You've been transparent with me this whole time. I think I'm in love. You've been transparent with me this whole time. Okay, we'll move uh, across the room. Mysterious pile. Mysterious pile. Is this space dust? Oh, it's just piles and piles of little papers <laughs> and dead jokes on them. One says, I am a dad. I am responsible for my children and being witty. This is too much stress and responsibility for me to handle. I'm not sure whoever wrote these understands how jokes work. Hmm. Okay. Talk to you. a pile of dad jokes. Uh, use them. I can't use them all at the same time. Dad jokes aren't a power to be trifled with. That is correct. They are a power I given to those. I have to father a child to necessitate taking these. Who have earned it. Or have I? De definitely not. Mm. Not because I'm completely infertile or anything. I'm just socially incompetent. I see. Poster. It looks like it's been done by an anti Warhol clone. A literal clone, that is. But Shinsuke didn't really have much when it came to culture, so they just cloned celebrities to can't direct it. Oh. Hello, anti Warhol clone painting. Hello. Use it? Use it to increase my culture? Plus one culture? I don't really feel any different. <laughs> it except maybe an added I'm air of just joking. The anti Warhol clone made hundreds of these. They're useless. Fair. Okay. Uh, well, uh, octopus. I've seen my fair share of genetically enhanced talking octopodes, but one that is an apathetic retail cashier? It is truly an honor to experience this. I love the way Paradigm sees the world. Talk to it. Hello? Welcome to Hiroshi's Corner, your friendly local drug dealing vending machine. Other voice. We get you really high, and please don't die. Unless you have signed the appropriate paperwork. Uh, what's what's the the drug dealer like? like? Pretty paranoid, dude. He just assumes that the police are after him because of all the movies he watches. When, in fact, space dust is completely legal and actually backed by the Krush government pretty good cash flow, and its addicts are more productive than the alcoholics. That's why governments love it so much. The Eastern European ones, anyway. Where I come from, in the ocean, there was only semen as our government. Dude liked to French kiss fish a lot. Not that name. I hesitate to call him a leader. You mean to tell me that this is an entirely legal drug this entire time? Great. Do you get tea bricks? Yes, actually. 
frankly, it's the only thing I won't complain about. I freaking love tea. Refreshing like water, but a little more satisfying, you know? Like a Definitely. treat, but one that doesn't make you feel fat. Of course I don't have breaks. I'm an enslaved, mutated octopus in a vending machine. Fair. Sorry. How did you, get this, did you job? get this job? A pretty easy application process of being taken out of the ocean, mutated, then forced into a non-paying retail job. Uh, On the upside, I get to wear Yay. this hat, I guess. You don't get to do that in the ocean. It just isn't practical. Hmm. Uh, what is super what crack? What is super crack? Unlike better, regular yeah. crack, That's super crack super. gives you superpowers. What kind of superpowers? After eating super crack, you get super euphoria. Isn't that just like uh, regular crack? No, not according to our lawyers anyway. We also own the rights to super super crack. Oh my gosh. What about super what super about crack? What about super super crack? That's something really special. Gets you high for six months straight. The hallucinations and psychosis <laughs> and deprivation alone is worth it. If you want it, I need at least three forms of ID, your life insurance number, and a high-res photo of your ankle. Why? Why the last part? Yeah. I'll be totally honest. I don't need the photo. I just like to see how far I can go before customers notice what I ask for. You'd be surprised. I own at least three human souls. Damn, girl. Okay, I want to ask I you something else. I want to ask you something else. Uh, I'd like to, I'd like to purchase. purchase some drugs, please. Certainly, sir. What drugs were you looking for? Space dust, please. Please take your super fun, cool drug enthusiast tokens and place them in the correct slot on the right. And remember, we get you really high, and please don't die. <laughs> don't have any tokens with unnecessarily long names. Ugh. <laughs> Paradigm space. All right, Jeez. well, just get a super fun, cool drug enthusiast token from the blob of flesh over there, Ooh. and then you can get some drugs. Now, please, can you leave me to my entitled apathy? I'll come okay, back later. Fine. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you. You too. I'll try to make the best out of eternal slavery. Sorry. Jeez. Plether chair. Must be some sort of a gaming chair. I can tell by the sweat, stains, food crumbs, and the name so done. Super Elite Master Ultimate Performance Chair. Yes. Good. Hello, Chair. Hello, Chair. You helped many noobs be slain. Yes. This is my gaming uh, chair. might ruin his butt groove. And if he is anything like me, you can't he'll be awfully upset. You can't Do you ruin know how long it takes to craft those things? Ages. Serious dedication Ages. is needed for the procrastination arts. You have to sit down in the exact same spot each time, and I know way too much about the... Chairs, butt grooves. Stop. <laughs> How about we change roles and you can sit on me? Don't flirt with the chair. What is wrong with you? I... Okay. Wait, before I look at the Super Mario War pipe, uh, look at the small TV. I'm not entirely sure what the point of the smaller one is. Maybe it's to make the large one look even bigger. Kind of like when you shave the hedges. Mm hmm. Mm. Hello, smaller TV. Hello, smaller TV. Yours My favorite show is on soon. Murder, she rapped. Who knew a woman over 100 could have <laughs> such good flow? Eminem's granny. It's not the screen size that counts. It's the distance you sit from it. Fair? Sure. Big TV. Poopsonic X2. I've heard about this model. It's huge. Why the downside is... is that it emits radiation, causing infertility. Oh. <laughs> Why is it called Poop Sonic? Low overcompensation. <laughs> I'll have to ask the drug dealer. Yeah, low overcompensation. Unfortunately, I am not the truck. <laughs> if I was, though, I'd definitely transform. That is the correct response. <laughs> is that what a transformer sounds like? Hey, look, it's a Mega Bro Avoid the Reality System. Never has escapism been so satisfying. Not augmented reality. 
a void reality. If I could marry a big inanimate object, it would be you, Mega Bro. Oh. I yes. better talk to the drug dealer first before I go around touching his stuff. Pick it up. I want to play you so hard. <laughs> Pick it up less. Look at the controller. It looks like it's uh, busted on <clears throat> one side and covered in sticky soda pop. Okay. You. You control games and, by extension, you control my life. Yes. Fair. 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 He's I better talk to the drug dealer first before I go around touching stuff. Alright. Seeing as pick it up means flirt with it. I better talk oh. to the drug dealer first before I go around touching stuff. He doesn't say that then. Uh, before we deal with whatever the f fuck is going on over here, let's deal with the warp pipe. Hey, a warp pipe. I've always wondered what it's like inside. Don't want to know anymore. <laughs> Hello, Warpipe to Nintendo Nightmares. <laughs> hey, Warpipe, I've always wondered what it's like inside. Oh, if I press use and stop. Woohoo! Oh, Jesus, I don't want. Pick it up. Something, something, pipe in the window. <laughs> Fair. All right, fern. Sometimes I pretend I'm a predator and hide behind ferns, hunting the elusive self-respect. <laughs> Hello, indoor pot plant. <laughs> Hello, indoor pot plant. I will say it that to all of my cacti now. I don't I'll have any. I'll leave it be. Doug oh, the plants. <laughs> I'm not really a fern type guy. Pick up. I like my plants large and thick. <laughs> Don't say it like that. All right, let's deal Something with whatever is. About this is wrong. You but, don't uh, say. I don't think a social movement exists for this yet. What, what bearings Pick are it. in those blades? Pick up first. A big eight. I bet you can roll a bait with minimum resistance and maximum speed. Are you picking up the old oh, man? Yeah. What is? Oh, he's wearing roller blades. What? Part of me wants to try old man transport. Then I remember they are human beings with feelings. We're not so different, you and I. Oh, except for the more frequent bathroom trips. Okay, let's just talk to them and deal with Hello, whatever drug this silly is. Man. Hello, insert name here. Refer to their name if you can. It allows you to connect on a more friendly personal level. What? I think oh, you I'm messed that up. I'm just trying out some techniques I read in an audiobook. You definitely messed that up. Uh, there are like five people there living like here. How do you fund this? people living here. How did you even fund all of this? Well, I have accrued massive amounts of debt and conducted large-scale tax evasion. Oh. It's the main reason I'm so paranoid. I also watched Scarred Face at least 20 times. Oh, uh, okay. Mm-hmm. How do you grow chest hair so thick? It's impressive. I lather my chest with steak and sleep in a lumberjack shirt. Gross. To be honest, I'll give you a hot tip. <laughs> merkins double up perfectly as a chest hair replacement. What are merkins? I'm not sure if that is better or worse. Hmm. What is your what name? What is your name? Torius Lightning Amorous. Re really? My father was an active D&D player. Oh no. I'm so sorry, dude. <laughs> Why did you want to become a drug dealer? I really wanted to contribute to my community. <laughs> to pay for life-saving surgery? <laughs> My father forced me into the profession. <laughs> All right. I just wanted to be baller for once. All right. You happy now? Look at me. I'm two feet tall, hairy, and fat. Sorry. <laughs> the deadpan expression is... You riding an old... Are you riding an old man on rollerblades? Yes. The elderly are great cheap labor. The roller skates are pure efficiency. Isn't this terribly demeaning for the guy? Yeah. Not when you can't remember your own name. Mm -hmm. Valid? Question mark? 
Can I buy some space dust now? I think I've gone through enough. Well, if you have a thousand cruise marks, I can give you the token for the vending machine over there. Oh my word. I don't have the cash for that. Also, Why are these people token? missing noses? Super fun, cool, drug enthusiast drug tokens. The official currency for the vending machine. No space dust for you. But tough biddies. Oh. <laughs> I'm sure, I'm sure we can come offer to that. an understanding. <laughs> the wink. What does that the wink mean? Wink. I don't know. I saw it in a movie once. Thought it might work. Nope. <laughs> Is there uh, anything else I can do? Yeah, okay. I can bake a mean cupcake that will mean blow your cupcake. mind. Alright. No one ever buys from me anyway. So I'll play you for it. Yes? If you can beat my game's high score, I'll give you a super fun, cool drug enthusiast drug token. Uh, what game is that? Prepare your body. It's the most brutal, unforgiving game ever developed. Oh, okay. An underground classic sought by collectors everywhere. Behold! Damn it, it's not working. Hold on. God damn piece of shit ruining my finely crafted atmosphere. I'm never buying floor stock again. Activate cartridge blow. <laughs> okay. What is it about? Try it for yourself. Grab that controller over there. Oh, okay. Yes. Oh, dude, gross. This controller is all sticky and only leads to one side. I can't play with this. That's what C said. <laughs> Isn't it she said? <laughs> yeah, and my online comedian degree is a scam. Who thought you could get full-fledged degrees it in three days and only at the price of full control of my life insurance? Oh. Bargain. Next week is a scene field masterclass. Anyway, you're stuck with the guest controller. No. Deal with it. Oh man, I can't deal with this. I'll need another controller. Okay. Uh, the game crashes when I do this, so let's hope that it doesn't this time. Please, don't crash. Okay, good. Um, okay, so I know where the other controller is. I've been here before. It is here. Pick up. I guess it could be handy. Alrighty, let me go back. <coughs> uh, where were we? Oh, this guy. Go this way. Back inside. Uh, and then... Voila. Put this down. Man, guess only controllers are such bullshit. Hey, drug dealer! There's your self-respect on the roof. What? Let's play this thing. <laughs> there we All go, right, changed let's it. let's do this. Time to bust some thug heads with positive reinforcement. Before they know it, they'll have a mortgage and be in a loveless but financially stable relationship. Oh. That's sad. Alright, press the letter Z to jump. Alright. Peace. Press the letter X to punch. A video game within a video game. Let's go. These don't help you at all in this game, although it will help keep your cardio up and your cholesterol down. Your mission is to boost Thug's like, self-esteem with compliments and make them- I didn't get that. Go practice on that sandwich over there. B to boost? Press B to boost. 
Yo, San, what do you do? You can deliver these? That's a mommy. I'm impressed. This one. You would be at least $3 at the local deli. Good job. I'm a sign. Terrible surprise. Thug boosted. I can't actually jump with <laughs> She doesn't let me. Are we gonna boost the orc? Oh, hello. Hello. Give me all your mana. Prepare to die. Tubular. Uh, beat a boost. Oh, I can jump. <laughs> nice shades, dude. That designer, you can tell me you have a better than average salary. But your staff has plus 10 to being a cool guy. Nice one. This one. Whoa, is that magic? You could probably have your own TV show or something. Or at least cosplay to cry. You're basically a celebrity. <laughs> Wow. Is it a prostitute mouse? Thug boot. We keep going. Dank pipes. There's some good music though. Like kid. Wanna aisle some Satan? Will it boost his self-esteem? I guess it would. I never thought of it that way. Oh, let's, let's do it. I'm not screaming that. Hello. Surprise you, Dweeb. Give me all your lo-fi recording equipment. <laughs> oh, sorry. I paid her. That's boring. Beat a boost. Uh. Sweet guitar, dude. I bet you could start your own one-man black metal band that has a small but loyal following. <laughs> that's why I'm doing street crime in the first place. At least it's one form of grim brutality. No, I saw that lightning thing. Cool. Being able, being able to control the elements would look <laughs> awesome on a resume. You're right next to experienced, struggling black metal musician. Nice makeup. You could probably have a solid career out of that, or at least a semi-successful internet show. <laughs> How about that one? Oh, I never considered that. It's always been my dream, but I didn't think it was a viable career option. Well then, thanks, Duder. Back to the depths of hell to get my makeup supplies. I thought his name was Duder. Level up. Okay. Hmm. Continue game. Input password using Z and X or press B to exit. I... Oh, yes. I boosted the hell out of those thugs. Okay, come tell them. Yeah, you did pretty well. Only 34,123 levels to go. Uh... What? Really? I don't have time for this. I have actual stuff to do. I don't Oops. believe you. Uh, true. <laughs> Still. Still, no space dust. I'm Altis. <sighs> Psst. I think I can help you be boosting thugs. Oh. The octopus knows yeah. things. Legends say that there is a mythical code to beat any Mega Bro game. Like a Konami cult? For legal reasons, no. <laughs> well, how can I get it? It's said to be lost to time and space. I don't believe you. Forever. Yeah, sick. That's great help. Let me finish, Jesus. <laughs> there are whisperings that it can be found lost in electromagnetic waves. Thanks, I think. Uh, can I have a better hint? Uh, can I have a better hint? That's all I can say. Bull. Yes, but can I have a slightly superior hint? <laughs> hey man, I'm trying to help you out as much as I can. Hint? Hint? No. Please, miss, can you spare some hint? Jeez, Just a of hint? fine. Okay. Radio waves. It's stuck in radio waves. Last time I make a cool setup. Mega Bro did a special promotion where they hid their ultimate cheat code within their advertisements. Why are you helping me get free space dust? I just really hate the drug dealer, to be honest. Fair. Uh, 
can I ask you anything more or no? Oh, I'll yeah. come back later. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, we're exiting through the window, baby. Windows, the most efficient exit. And the coolest. Alright. I know where to deal with radio waves. I went around thinking that there would be satellite dishes or something. There's this weird cable out by Space Cadet, which is just a cable for some reason. Uh, it's not there, it's in Paradigm Shop. God, I hate that dog. Okay, use the radio. Let's check out what's on the radio. Oh, I skipped. Whoa, whoa, Wait, whoa, hold whoa, on. Whoa, whoa, welcome! Uh, this is advertisement radio. We're just so you can see it. Just, just some thorough. Hmm, look at it. It's a radio that they managed to get working finally. Too bad there are only like three stations. One is a regular music station. The second is just hours upon hours of some neurotic guy narrating everything around him. The third is 24-7 advertisements. There we go. Let's check out what's on the radio. Whoa, 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 welcome! This is Advertisement Radio, where we play advertisements all day, every day, from around the world. From around the world! A world where you spend every last cent of your savings, and then your wife leaves you. Taking your dog. Taking your favorite hat. Taking your hemorrhoid donut cushion. Eventually leaving you to heat up a can of beans with your butane lighter. And then you're left staring at your blank wall because your TV was taken too. Haha, <laughs> enough about me. Let's get into the advertisement. <laughs> Hey there, Billy. Been through these Do you before. like video games? Yeah! Do you like gross amounts of virtual violence? Yeah! Yeah! Do you like doing taxis? What? I'm 11 years old, mister. <laughs> well, then you'll love our new game from Mega Bro, the company that brought you such hits as Boosting Thugs, Zeldario Zany Man Exo, Introducing Tax Evasion. The game. the game! Play as multi-dimensional company with fun gameplay such as threaten or bribe government officials. Choose which offshore countries to put your profit. We went through this one. Recruit the a dream second, team of lawyers. Find and silence whistleblowers. Whoa, cool! Available March 4th, 2025. Oh no, Grandma is gone. What do we tell Billy? Don't tell Billy a thing. Gran Insurance is here to help. We'll send a clone replacement to Grandma within one business day. She'll be baking cookies straight out the stasis box in no time. Just remember to clean the stasis liquid or uncontrollable bloodlust may occur. We'll guarantee a <laughs> cookie cooking sweater knitting sleigh for years to come. Available at clonegrandma.com. Thanks, Grandma Insurance. What would we have done without you? Hmm. Gene Pierce's This Decade's Modern Musical Genius is about to drop his new, most anticipated album mm -hmm. of 2026. Mm -hmm. Our love is drifting apart. Mm. Here's a small sample. Mmm, amazing. No. How does one duck contain so much talent? I'm sorry, did you say duck? This Sunday at the Motorplex, Fighting Icons! We bring back the clones of icons throughout history and answer the age-old question. Who would win in a fistfight between Abraham Lincoln and Gandhi? Hitler and Joy the Kangaroo? Beethoven and Biggie Smalls? This Sunday, 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 Sunday,
Oh, money bag, Hello, not body bag. I'm Liliana, your local Baba Yagavich, offering my services on the weekend half price. Neighbors on your nerves, I'll curse them. Half price. Half price. Can't find a husband or wife by morally questionable but romantic love potions. Half price. <laughs> Hate your husband by erectile dysfunction potion. Half price. Call 058984981 for a price today. And then it repeats. Turn it off before I go. So, it's here. In this one, Mega Bro Tax Evasion the Game from the company that brought you such hits as Boost Thugs. Z, Z, X, X. <laughs> said, said, exit. There it is. Back. Goodbye, horrifying, mutated excuse of a dog. Alrighty, we go in. And I drink some more of my wonderful ginger tea. I totally not sponsor of this video. But I would love it if they did. All right, I have to put it in here, right? Use. All right, said. Uh oh, I made a mistake. I tapped out of the oops. Zed said. I said. Take that! I boosted the hell out of those thugs. There we oh, go. Yes. Man, what the hell? You totally cheated. Yes. Some Konami code bullshit. Come on, man. He has a beak. The deal is a deal. Oh, god damn it. Here, my last super drug enthusiast token. By the way, some big guy was looking for you. Oh. Super nice. Apparently wanted to dissect you for some reason or another. You're only telling me this now? To be honest, I'm just super stressed about how I'm going to pay the bank back for all those high interest loans for all this gear. Then why did you buy it? New inventory item. Oh, I got the token. Use it here. <coughs> Free drugs. Free I'm drugs. living the dream. One space dust, please. <laughs> One space dust, please. Space Enjoy dust. your space dust. Thank you. Finally, time to get that floppy disk and uh, and not you know die horrible death. Yes. Damn. Where is he? Oh, something broke the top oh. of his helmet. No. You better not be dead. Why did you have to pass out now? Wait a second. No. Oh. You mean you were sitting on the box of these the whole time? <laughs> really? Yeah, it's good to see you still have motor functions, judging by the twitch of your leg. Now let's go save Kurush from inevitable destruction. At least for a little bit longer, so I can make some beaties. Observe him. Looks like some No, not that. It's just him. Oh, maybe I can't. Look at. Look at these. Ugh, he had a full box of them this whole time. If he wakes up, I am done with him. <laughs> Alright. Hello, to? Floppy, I need so no one dies and I can work on my EP. <laughs> that was a little R2D2. On top of the screen. Uh, the, 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 the television. Television. Use these. If I get back, and it turns out John just <sighs> wanted me out of the house. To hook up with some biddies, I swear to DJ Jesus, I will make Internet Explorer the default web browser and wave a magnet over his hard drive. Those some fighting words. Hello? Oh, Doug! No! Doug! What did they do to you? Paradigm. Come close. I have one last bit. Oh, no, Doug. Save your not... energy. 
We need to get you to a hospital. What happened? Beradine, I've always considered you my best friend. It's so sad. I owe you this one less. <laughs> no! <laughs> Doug, I will avenge you. Wait. Shit. Oh man, you asshole. You faked your own death to avoid paying rent? Maybe. <laughs> Baby. That's the last time I have a heartfelt moment for you. <laughs> Wait, can I... Supposedly dying Doug. Look at him. Look at him. It's the worst tenant you will ever see. A mid-tier new show ought to make an average but entertaining story out of him. You would end up watching it just because you couldn't be bothered changing the channel. Talk to I'm him. not talking to him till he realizes pretending to kill yourself comes with real-world consequences. Oh, no more daily moisturizing for you, mister. Did you moisturize him daily? Why would you do He's, this? He's uh, already manipulating me and using my emotions. Never again. Oh. Pick up. I'm going to leave him there till he learns his lesson. No. Or until the local bears come foraging for food. They're vegan and would cook up a storm with eggplants. <laughs> oh, I see. Interesting. What are you? He sure is blocking my way. That constant bopping is making me nervous. Uh, Pretty sure he wants up. to kill me. I don't think that would be a Not good start to a pick up healthy relationship. Bad way. I'm pretty him. keen to use his head as a fishbowl if I do end up defeating him somehow. I see. Talk to him. Uh, why the incessant bopping? Why the incessant bopping? Malkanax, your voice is gonna get super annoying super quickly. How are, How are you? you? Good I think he's from Dupa. I think that says... Well, I don't know what it says here, but... I might say Dupa. Is that not some form of... cannibalism? No. I mean, he's water, he needs to survive. Man, science is weird as hell. Where do you come Where from? Where do you come from? Is that uh, really the official branding? You're doing a great job, dude. Course. Absolutely right. Good life choices, good life decisions. Totally sentient water. What are you? Can robots even drink beer? No, no, please do elaborate. Right. Elaborate. Could you maybe elaborate? Me. Not to mention not 
Fair. Uh, so how does the drinking does, uh, beer work? Drinking beer work. <laughs> but Mr. Sentient Water Henchman, you were a cool guy all along. Just tap your feet twice. Oh, Roomba? Uh, Roomba? Oh. oh, I would like to see that. I, I would watch that. I would watch a Roomba with mounted machine guns take on the world. Okay, properly, uh, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Well, interesting. More specifically, what you're doing here. Yes. Ah, looking for paradigm. Okay. Uh, you're a glorified. You're a glorified lock. You don't have any teeth. Yeah. <laughs> that would look good. Heck yeah. Okay. Are you talking, Are you talking uh, physical, physical or metaphysical? Or metaphysical door? Blocking the door. <laughs> Alright. What does he look like? What does he look like? That's mean. Bro, <laughs> calm down, the feelings. Uh, hmm. I am not Pete Medusa, excuse me. Nothing. Just remembered some fictional c character I'd be more upset about dying than most people. Uh -huh. <laughs> Parent, I'm sorry. <laughs> what is a prodigy child? It's pretty rough. Yeah. Well, anyway, this one is free. Let's talk up. Boss needs to get back for whatever reason. So, then I am. I see. Can you just let me through? Can you just let me through? Not really. I'm probably who's locked up and who is going into the corner. Not discussing water. Do not hurt a victim. Nothing? At all? What did I do? Fair. Fair. Look, a three headed monkey. Look, a three headed monkey. Okay, fine. What if fine. I. Uh... Serviced you. I only get it from the Charlie Dog. Damn, okay. It's a tip up. I'm not a man. I'm the immortal mountain. I see. Uh, what if I ask you like this? What if I ask you like this? Can you 
let me through? He would have asked you like this. What if I ask you like this? <laughs> what? <laughs> I'd write I you a love song? Love song? Uh, uh, no, no. Do you have any hopes and dreams you want How to fulfill? Do you have any hopes and dreams you want to fulfill? To be on a little will never really find out. Oh. I always want to go back to my water roots. Why don't you? Yeah. Do you got what if I told you? Time to put boosting thugs to good use. Oh gosh. <laughs> Ready. Cool. Boost. Boost. <laughs> Boosting thugs. What? <laughs> Round two. <laughs> oh, it's Doug who's doing it at the bottom there. <laughs> right. I bet you can take so much fluoride, you're like a magical shield. <laughs> The emotional shield allows me to venture into the real world. Nope. He's the most majestic bop I've ever seen. Wow. You're looking pretty good today. Thanks, but you know, that's like my extra. What did he say? I was too busy bopping. Like my external shell. Not the real me, you know? <laughs> Alright, so many hot models would love you. You're like zero calories. Hot. Wow, you really think so? Models? I didn't even think of the possibility. Thanks, man. <laughs> Jeez. I'm boosted. Just to make up, you really believe that? Yeah, of course. Yeah, definitely. Oh. I am uncomfortable with just how close they've put me to your smooth skin skin face. Your skin's very um mm. Oh no 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 What is that? That's not a smile. I mean, goodbye, sweet wizard. May the earth are you going back to Weird Sloth Man? Just teleport him into the offices! Come on, dude. You know Mr. Yorpodoskvesaki doesn't work well under aggressive management. Did you know? Without Paradigm, we can't fix the others. And without fixing the others, Dupe Genetics goes into the red. When we go into the red, Mr. Yorpodoskvesaki doesn't get his paycheck. Then, Mr. Yorpodoskovosoki can't pay for his subscription to Kawaii Cats Online! <laughs> oh, <laughs> don't, don't bring Kawaii Cats into this. That is my life! Regardless, this machine is janky as hell. Bob from accounting is still inside out from the last test. He had a body pillow who loved him very much. Mm. Now, not so much. Teleport him into the offices! Why not sure. the dungeon? The other faulty prodigy children are there. I don't want a revolution on my hands. Interesting. Just do what I say. All right. Jesus, dude. Bit vibes. Wait, did you just throw coffee in the machine? Are you sure? 
That's how it works? Excuse me, I think I know a little bit more about matter decompilers than you. I am the scientist here. <laughs> okay. Oh, yes. So goddamn pumped. Finally, time to make some fat beats, play some epic music. Nice. Oh, Dabo. I was looking forward to a third apocalypse. Maybe some mutated mold could replace you. Excuse me. Oh, that would have far more personality. Mold the adventure game. Do you know the wounds I sustained to my confidence outside, away. John? I'm going to ignore <laughs> that you said that, and let's boot up this bad boy. Yeah, what? Well, wait a miser. Okay. <laughs> John singing the song of his people while he waits. Alright, done. Put in the flobby to continue chasing your unreachable dreams. Oh, John, would you take me down? Now that I can do it, I don't really feel like it. Come on, mate, this happens every time. Can't really force inspiration, man. I guess I might as well browse endlessly and discover <gasps> fetishes I never realized I had. No. <laughs> what the hell was that? Jesus <laughs> Christ! <laughs> I've got three bitty methods. <laughs> Man, that was really weird. <laughs> John, you're gonna over. comment no. on the oh, paradigm experiencing. Bloody hell, they were just bots. I knew it was too good to be true. I should have caught on when they asked me for my credit card number. Oh, where am I now? Act two. Oh god, where am I? I didn't know there were acts to this. I'm- wow. Okay, this is a lot longer than I thought it'd be. Welcome to the multiverse. Here, you are one with each of your multidimensional forms. Ugh. Ow. It hurts. Hey, it's not so bad the second time. Who are you? Is there a manager for this multiverse? Because if there is, I am going to have to speak to him. I, uh, I, I guess I'm technically the manager. Damn it, you messed up my spiel. I'm going to start again. I am the all-seeing keeper of the multiverse. My ultimate purpose is to tell you. Tell me what? Just shut up for a <laughs> second. You, you are the chosen one. What the woo? I don't like that one. This is cool though. What? Really? Do I get any powers? I don't need much. Self-esteem would be pretty great if you have any of that left. Oh, no. Gosh. Are you sure? Last time I was told I was the chosen one, they wanted my credit card number. Serious? I've always thought I had a jawline for it. Okay, this one. What? First one. Really? Do I get any powers? I don't need much. Self-esteem would be pretty great if you have any of that left. No! <laughs> What I did to you was what us multiverse keepers call, in the biz, rustling jimmies. <laughs> People sometimes breach the multiverse from messing around with teleportation. We just like to mess with people's heads. You aren't the chosen one. You do have a semi-important part, though. The actual chosen one is a way cooler, 25 to 35 year old black haired male with a gruff voice. Like every other anyway, chosen one. <laughs> your time is up. Peace. Wait, can I ask you something else before I go? Uh, yeah, I, I guess. Uh, what is the meaning of life? What is the true art? Do dogs have internal monologues? I have Do to ask. Do dogs that. have internal monologues? The answer. Is yes. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I Jimmy, love you didn't tell me. That you didn't, you didn't tell me. Up. Why didn't you tell me? You suck. Dupa. Oh, that's not a fun sign. What are those legs? Oh wait, is this the other side of the butt mountain? The structure thing. Stop it, Damn it. 
I was this close to knowing the answer to life's greatest question. Well, welcome to my dungeon. You are now my prisoner for eternity. Hello? Forever tormented by the thing that once gave you refreshment. It's more sentient now. Now only providing you with never ending pain. <laughs> Ugh, deja vu. Oh well then, almighty oh tormentor. Speaking of refreshing beverages, my throat is quite parched, as I presumably was split into a million pieces and transported through time and space. Can I trouble you for one? Silence! Oh. My refreshing days are over. Bow down to the eternal sound of the forever restarting refrigerator motor. No, no, May not that. May it be a reminder <laughs> that. of your sins. <laughs> Never have I heard such a horrifying sound. Yeah, just wait till you're just about to fall asleep. And this bad boy kicks in. You're gonna be so irritated. I will be sure to heed that warning, water cooler of doom. <laughs> I'm glad you're starting to show some respect. If you're lucky, I'll let you lick my nipple nozzles. Do you really have yeah, to Yeah, I'm with you on that power then. Well, if you can think of a better name for them, I'm all ears. Tips? Ugh. The hell? A sick man, Paradigm. Sick! I got to get out of this office prison room thing. I am with him on tabs. Okay. Wow. I was told this was a crazy game. It is. Why is there a head there? Hello? Jeeves? Okay, I'm gonna leave this one here. I do not know which direction this is going in. What? <laughs> Be like the circle. What are these posters around the office? Okay, next time. Next time we will handle this. Kyle. Are you enjoying this game? Yes? Okay. I am too. Will we see these wonderful people next time? Yes, I hope so. I really hope so. That's all for this video. This crazy messed up game. <laughs> I'll see you in the next one. Okay. I have a ghost before this is bye bye. Bye. <laughs>